Welcome everyone to another video. Today we are testing F-Secure Antivirus and we are using a free trial to do this test. And I do have a folder with a bunch of samples of malware, 139 samples in total. And so we will be using this list of samples to test F-Secure to see how well it does or does not do as far as protecting us against these specific threats. The procedure will be as follows. In a moment, I will enable the real-time protection here on F-Secure. We'll let it sit for just a few moments to see if it can detect anything on its own, after which we will run a system scan. And if there's any samples remaining, we will go ahead and run a scan here on the samples folder directly. And then after that, if there's still samples remaining, we'll go ahead and execute them and see if the real-time protection can stop them. Before we begin, let's just double check to make sure that F-Secure is up to date. And now that we are up to date, we'll go ahead and turn all of the protections on. And at this point, we'll go ahead and let it sit for just a few moments to see if it detects anything on its own. All right, so far I haven't noticed anything pop up. Let's check our folder. And it looks like it may have detected some because this number is starting to go down, but I believe opening the folder initiated that. So we'll let it do its thing, but we're going to go ahead and start a scan anyways and we will be back with the results. All right, it says it found only one item, but I assume it most likely removed several more in the background. So let's go ahead and take care of this one. And when I open up the quarantine list here, we can see that we've got a lot of items uh, in here. And so if we open up our samples folder, we can see that that reflects what's missing. So at this point, let's go ahead and close these and we're going to try to scan the samples folder directly. And we will go ahead and click on handle all. And it looks like it's having trouble removing one of the items. Let's just try one more time, just to give it another chance. And if I click on the item, uh, let's go ahead and quarantine. And there we go. So we should still have a few remaining samples. So at this point, we're going to go ahead and execute the remaining. And at this point, we'll go ahead and restart the computer and run some second opinion scans. Malwarebytes came back with two results positive, so we'll go ahead and quarantine. After another computer restart, I ran a scan with MZSoft, which came back clean with zero results detected. Just a quick recap, F-Secure detected most of the results when I opened up the samples folder, as well as it found an additional result upon the system scan, as well as one more when I did a direct scan of the samples folder. Please note that Malwarebytes and MZSoft did miss two additional results as well as F-Secure. And then I should also note that we did end up with an additional application here, which is malware. So please be aware that those did get through. Regardless, you can take these results and draw your own conclusions. But that's everything for this video. If you have any comments or questions, please post them down below. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you have a great day. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you found it helpful, please go ahead and consider sharing it. And please also consider subscribing to my channel and don't forget to hit that bell icon to get notifications on future videos.